Previously on The Walking Dead. I'm freezing. Wait till we get up to Wellington. Then talk to me about coal. Krista. I'm gonna go look for more wood. Where's the rest of your group? I I'm by myself. Bullshit. Krista, run! I'm out. Grab her. Let's go. Would someone mind telling me what the fuck is going on here? Bit by a dog. For all we know, she could be working with Carver. So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I don't know. I'm kind of on my own now. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? You were in the woods with Krista. Please. Ah! I'm fine. I'm fine. Just... just lost my footing. Damn it. God damn it. Come this way! Damn it, you get your asses over here, both of you! Oh boy, are you guys ready? <sighs> so ready. Are they hiding in the trap? Well, they shouldn't be able to get through that. On the downside, we can't get through them. So did he just lose his footing or is it a bite? What are you looking at? Staring ain't polite. Come on out and say it. <laughs> How are you feeling? Well, other than this bite, I'm just peachy. Oh, it is a bite! Oh, no! Hand me that there. Oh, no! Oh! Oh, he's gonna do it to himself? He'll pass out from the pain. He's gonna make so much noise. Like a stuck pig. What are you gonna do? Carry me out of here on your back? Hell. Just... Just give me a minute. Try to get some rest. But if you're gonna There's cut it off... stuff in here. I'll try you to have to cut it off quick. Maybe we'll find something for a tourniquet. God, you know, I don't trust this game anymore. I never know when it's going to make me cry. Like, I don't feel like crying now, but I don't know what it's going to do. Anything in that. Sorry, it's empty. Oh, that sucks. Damn. I'll keep looking around. I guess because we gave the water to the other guy, damn, who's probably definitely dead now after Walker surrounded everything. Oh, I could probably move, huh? Oh, Nick. 
That's stupid, kid. Drive away? Oh, let's try the radio first. Nope. Off to a grim start. Hey, there's more up here. Crush hazard. So there's a crane we could use maybe on all these walkers. Right. The keys are still in it. Well, worth a shot. Clementine, you don't know how to drive. And Pete, <laughs> I don't know how good your leg is to drive. Out of gas. Ah. Uh, Welp. I'm not seeing anything else here. What's in there? Anything we can use? Cigarettes. Give me one of those. Probably tastes like pine tar by now, but I'd smoke a dead coon's tail if you had one. Hand it here. Will you show me how to do it? Hell no. <laughs> Why not? Ellen Breslin. San Bernardino Borden School, June 63. One pack and I was hooked. <laughs> that broad. Couldn't kiss worth a damn. Got a light? She does have her cute little lighter. I'm just making Clementine a big old rebel. <laughs> well, that tastes about as bad as it smells. Now what? <sighs> we wait. I didn't even know cigarettes go bad. Couldn't they, like, use one of their shirts? Like, couldn't he use his shirt as a tourniquet or something to wrap around? I don't know. Uh-oh. <laughs> He's in pain. really sucks that if we just had a tourniquet, we could have saved him. Pete? <laughs> oh, damn it. I feel like ten pounds of shit in a five-pound sack. <coughs> It's funny, but I feel bad for him. Jesus. Oh. Stuck in this can the whole damn day. His eyes are turning yellow. You want to hear something funny? I've been no. thinking. And I don't want to die. <laughs> I never thought I'd be the kind of idiot to say something like that. But there it is. I'm scared, Clementine. Jesus, I'm scared. What does it feel like? Uh, it feels like... Like a rope was wrapped around my neck. I'm getting tighter every second. It feels like I can't... <coughs> can't breathe. Would you... Would you promise me you'll watch out for Nick? I love that stupid kid. No matter what you think. Well, I'm just a kid, a but boy. sure. I'll do what I can. Thank you. Been almost a day. They ain't gonna find us. Where are you going? 
to distract the walkers. I do I'm not want to cry. You're gonna have to make a break for it. I'll buy you some time. Damn it. You're coming with me. To do what? Die a couple hours later than now? To say goodbye to Nick. All right. I'll try. Well, like my daddy used to say, <clears throat> we're burning daylight. Let's get this over with. hearing someone say they don't want to die you don't get to see that human side of these survivors very often that was sad ah oh, and having to tell them is going to be the worst Clementine are you alright Luke's not with you Where's Alvin? What happened? It's been hours. Where are they? Clem! We got attacked. By who? Walkers. Jesus! We all got split up. I was with Pete, but... Thank God. Where were you? Where were you exactly? Down by the stream. We gotta go. Just hold on a minute. My husband is still out there! Get the guns! Luke and Alvin went out looking for you. I told them not to go. Damn it, Luke. Knew Luke was a good guy. Clementine, can you, can you please watch Sarah? She's upstairs. Just distract her. And don't tell her anything. She gets nervous. Just go. <sighs> Hurry. You'll be safe inside. Just don't open the doors for anything. We'll be back soon. They won't be safe. I just don't think they'd be better going with them or else I would have suggested that. He wanted us to stay away stay from tuned. Sarah. I found this under the house. There was all kinds of old stuff. It's so cool. Take one of <laughs> me. Come on, take one of me. Please. I'm just going to be nice to her. Sure. Get me in a good pose, okay? Okay, I'm ready. What's wrong? Um, where's my dad? Clem, uh. you're scaring me. He'll be fine. Are you sure? Sorry, I, I, I just need to... I wonder what's wrong with her. You want to see what I found? Will you show me how to use it? I couldn't find any bullets. If something's wrong, I should know. What if I have to use one? Okay, but it's not a toy. I know. First, remember, it's just a thing. What does that mean? 
Um, I don't know. I thought it'd be heavier. Okay. What do I do? I figured I'd show her. Thing is, always aim for the head. Okay. For her own protection. Unless but... it's a person trying to hurt you, then what do I do? Just keep shooting. It's so what sweet hearing. Don't do that. S -s -s sorry, sorry. Maybe I could practice outside. There's that tree. Hey, look back. It's so sweet hearing Clementine say the things that Lee taught her. I'm afraid that showing Sarah how to use the gun is going to isolate us with Carlos, but I'm trying to kind of be neutral with both of them. Can I go all the way? Nope. He's back and there's no Alvin. They make Clementine walk so slow and make her look so timid. Ooh, chess. I don't remember. Whoa. This probably won't do anything. I don't remember chess being there last time we looked. Guess it doesn't matter. I think last time it, it was cards. <gasps> Clem, I think I know him. Is that Carver? He can't see me. You have to make him go away. Why can't he Why? see you? Why can't he see you? Oh. Clem, I can't breathe. I can't, I can't breathe. She has panic Shh. attacks. They need to hide. Clementine's gonna Hello. answer? No. Anybody home? He's gonna hear that. Hello. I'm not doing it. They should go hide. No! That's not what okay. I wanted. <laughs> Get out, I have a gun. Who are you? <laughs> well, actually, I'm your neighbor. Neighbor? This is... That's right. My family and I are set up a ways down river. I'm kind of surprised we haven't run into each other yet. What's your name? Carly. What's your name? <laughs> My name is George, honey. I'm not shaking it. Pleasure to meet you. That's right. You give him that skeptical look. You mind if I come in for a bit? Yes, I do mind. This is a nice place. Is there anyone else around? You don't usually see cabins this big out here. Sure could pack a lot of folks in there. I'm not answering. I don't want to give any information. Hey, you can talk to me, all right? I'm not gonna bite you. Well, I'll cut to the chase. I'm out looking for my people. Seven of them, to be exact. They've been gone a long while, and I'm worried they might have gotten lost. Maybe you've seen them. A couple of farm boys and an old man. Spanish guy and his daughter. Quiet girl. A bit taller than you. Big That's black this guy. group. This big. It's Carlos. And a pretty little pregnant lady. That's a lot of people to lose. Tell me about it. This whole damn thing's a pain in the ass. Uh, or not Carlos. Did I say Carlos? I meant Carver, if I did. No, no, no. This is not good. He's gonna see all those plates. Ugh. A lot of plates for one person. Looks like yeah, a tornado what? ran through here. I don't ever do the dishes. Okay, well, believe me, I don't either. Just passing through, or you've been here a while? Hey, listen, kid. I hope you're not one of those nuts headed up north looking for Shangri-La. Now, I'm not sure why you'd go anywhere after finding this place. Hell, I just Ooh. got here, and I already don't want to leave. Ooh. Where does this go? I'll take it. I'll take it. Oh, I'll take it. Oh, you... Mm. Well, it's a real nice place. Kind of cozy. Get out. 
I knew a guy that always wore shirts like this. Doctor. Oh. Real smug son of a bitch. But a smart man. And this What happened to what him? What happened to him? Let's just say we had our differences. Sooner Get or out. later, people close to you will find a reason to cross you. Happens every time. Giving me the heebie-jeebies. Well, well. White's in trouble. Three moves away from checkmate. What was that? Just a creaky old house. Nothing to see here. No, get out. Get out of my house. I thought you said nobody's here. It's probably just the wind. No! Oh my god, I do not like this. Clementine, get him out of the house. I told you, nobody's here. Seems that way. Didn't mean to be rude. Couldn't just leave you here with a good conscience if someone was poking around, right? Oh, please, sure. get out. Who's this? <gasps> uh... Well, it's a kid. Yeah. Looks like it was taken in this room. Ah. Oh. You no, have no. no idea who these people are, do you? I don't know what you're talking about. Let me ask you this. When you met them, how much did they trust you? I'm not saying anything. I don't even want to confirm that we know them. Well, I think I've troubled you long enough. I can let myself out. Wait, who are you? You have a real good day now. I, oh, I also want to know what he was going to say. Where is he? He's gone. What if he comes back?